For Practice Update, I'm Dr. Farzana Hafizula. Today joining me, I have Dr. Manesh Mehta, Professor of Radiation Oncology at the University of Maryland. Dr. Mehta, thank you for joining us today. It's a pleasure. Any new advances that you'd like to share on what's happening with the standard of care or the usage of whole brain radiotherapy? So historically, whole brain radiotherapy has been used to control microscopic disease, mm -hmm. and it does a pretty good job of doing that. But one of the consequences of whole brain radiation is cognitive decline. Yes. And as a consequence, people have often shied away from its use in patients with this significant concern for cognitive decline. Uh, recently, a couple of randomized trials have been completed that show that there's potentially benefit from intervention using pharmacologic agents. So in one such trial conducted by the NRG oncology group, the use of an Alzheimer's drug, Memantin, yes. together with whole brain radiotherapy, showed that the patients that received memantin had superior preservation of cognition compared to those who didn't together with whole brain radiation. Sure, but there are so many amazing advances and a lot of scientific data still yet to come. We really appreciate you coming out today to share some of the practice update with us. Thank you for joining us for Practice Update. I'm Dr. Farzana Hafizullah with Dr. Manesh Mehta. Thank you. Pleasure. Thank you.